To answer your question earlier about suits, we can support you getting into suits at your discretion. It's your call. Just to note that the Soyuz crew is not in suits. And then heads up 15 minutes to the next debris field past TCA. Endurance copies. Is the uh, conjunction still yellow risk or has it changed? It's an equivalent yellow uh, for the next debris pass. And then also we, we are um, estimating that the probability of a hit to Dragon would be lower than the rest of ISS. And Houston Endurance, is uh, SpaceX on console to have a conversation on Dragon to ground about forward actions if we do have a, a hit? And Endurance also, Houston, like yes, uh, SpaceX is on console. If it's under half an hour, we are thinking about coming back on the station. If it's more than half an hour, we are thinking to stay suited and potentially come back home. This is all if Dragon takes a hit. And Endurance Houston, uh, alteration to that proposal, if, if Dragon takes a hit, we will get you back on station. We'll come back on the station regardless if uh, Endurance takes a hit. And Endurance Houston on Sitzgram 1, just want to reiterate that we think it's small likelihood that Dragon would get an impact. Endurance copy, thanks. The Russian Federation recklessly conducted a destructive satellite test of a direct ascent anti-satellite missile against one of its own satellites. The test has so far generated over 1,500 pieces of tra trackable orbitable debris and hundreds of thousands of pieces of smaller Orbital, orbital debris that now threaten the interests of all nations. In addition, this test will significantly increase the risk to astronauts and cosmonauts on the International Space Station, as well as to other human spaceflight activities. Russia's dangerous and irresponsible behavior jeopardizes the long-term sustainability of our outer space and clearly demonstrates that Russia's claims of opposing the weaponization of space are disingenuous and hypocritical. The United States will work with our allies and partners to respond to Russia's irresponsible act.